All right. Even if you're very, very new to rhythm bones, you probably know about the triplet. When you see bones players play flurries of notes, short to prolonged, they're usually some version of triplets. You can very versatile technique. You can play them very slowly all the way up to very quickly, and uh, they can be really effective. In its most basic form, I'll give you a short demonstration of the technique. One, two, three, one. Taki ta ta. One, two, three, one, two. One, two, three, one, two. One, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, three. Taki ta taki ta taki. So, triplet, useful technique. Let's boil it down. Basic Danforth grip here. Once again. So, from our kind of default playing position, elbows down, bones hung in a comfortable pendulum-like way. Again, it's the same rotation we were practicing with the tap only it's practiced sort of continually. My accents are always on the outward motion, at least in my style of bones playing. So it's, it's always one, two, three, or one, two, three, or one, two, three, or one, two, three. And right now I'm squeezing that hand, but if I were to loosen that hand, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, the bones would start bouncing against each other. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. It's me squeezing my hand, I loosen my grip, and the triplet just begins. Think about wax on, wax off from the Karate Kid. That idea that if you do the motion just right, your triplet will be beautiful. All momentum. It's all the bottom ends of the bones doing the work. It's a really a resonant set of bones. It's rosewood on the outside there. Kind of wings. And as you go faster, you involve more of the whole arm motion. All right, let's boil it down again. It's about 180 degrees of motion at its most extreme. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. At slow speed, you're going to be going through. From here, through here, through here. Not exactly sure that's where the three hits occur, but it's what it feels like. So I hope that helps give you a basis in what the triplet's all about. Stick around for the next video in this series, the fourth big technique, which is to say the quadruplet. Very useful technique, the quadruplet. All right, thanks for joining. Cheers.